One of our biggest goals while creating Divi has been to help designers be productive and improve efficiency in their workflows. That means empowering you to build beautiful websites and empowering you to build them quickly. To accomplish this, we created a tool that is both robust and easy to use, filled with all the customization options a designer would need and presented in a way that is intuitive. But at the foundation of all of those things is the speed of the application itself. And today's update is all about making the visual builder faster. Divi's Visual Builder is a front-end application built on the React JavaScript library. And today, we are updating that foundation to the latest version, React 16. With this comes inherent performance improvements along with new tools that allow us to build an even better, faster piece of software. It also means we can upgrade our entire tech stack, leveraging similar improvements from the community. We've done a lot more than just update our libraries. We've also greatly optimized the Visual Builder to improve performance when making changes to your page. To put it simply, when you customize the design of your page, those customizations will now appear much more quickly than before, reducing the feeling of lag or glitchiness and making the visual editing experience a whole lot more enjoyable. Each button click is snappy and responsive, adjusting the range sliders feels smooth and graceful, and exploring the color picker is just plain lovely. These performance improvements will be especially noticeable on older computers, which means the Visual Builder is becoming a whole lot more accessible to everyone. If you tried the Visual Builder in the past but were discouraged by feelings of slowness, go ahead and update to the latest version and give it another try because I think you'll be surprised by just how responsive and fast the Visual Builder has become. The better, faster Visual Builder powered by React 16 is available today, so download Divi and take it for a spin. Let us know what you think in the comments and don't forget to check back next week for even more great Divi updates coming your way.